Hi, this is Vijay Bambwani here and in this video, I'm going to give an update to natural gas traders about some pretty critical uh, events that have shaped up and impacted prices in the recent 72 hours and why our next trade in natural gas might just be postponed by a couple of trading sessions. Uh, recently, I recorded a video about uh, uh, events in uh, New South Wales in uh, Narabri in uh, Australia and how the natural gas uh, uh, project there uh, of $3.6 billion could actually impact prices as far away as India. If the Narabri project is to go ahead, the Australians will consume that much natural gas in-house and therefore there will be less left for exports, which would mean that natural gas prices could firm up in case the Narabri project comes up. If it, is if it doesn't, then the Australians have surplus natural gas which will come to the market and prices might just get hammered lower. But in the last couple of trading sessions, uh, uh, one uh, geopolitical event and one natural uh, uh, cause, one, one weather caused event has disrupted the price of natural gas. The first one, uh, tropical storms uh, uh, Marco and Laura were approaching uh, uh, the coast and of these two, uh, 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 storm um, uh, Marco is now a full-fledged hurricane. Now, uh, in the US uh, hurricane season, uh, basically, uh, you will see the coast uh, being cleared and the oil rigs and uh, gas rigs being vacated uh, as a precautionary measure to uh, stave off uh, loss of uh, life. And uh, we'll have to watch the events uh, by keeping our ears to the ground on uh, this Hurricane Marco and what really transpires with uh, uh, the tropical storm Laura. Uh, this, of course, uh, if the storm or the storms intensify, will push gas prices higher. But uh, uh, there was a geopolitical event in uh, Damascus, which uh, basically triggered off uh, some bullishness in uh, gas prices. Uh, there was an explosion, the sixth of its kind, mind you, sixth of its kind, uh, in Damascus, uh, 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 near the countryside uh, between Aldomer and Andhra. And uh, a gas pipe, which was of a uh, three-foot diameter, was blown up. Now, the Minister for Petroleum and uh, Mineral Resources, uh, Ali Ghanim, has uh, uh, basically uh, not ruled out anything, which means it could also be uh, a terror uh, attack. Of course, uh, details are awaited. Uh, we have nothing concrete as of now, but the fact remains that the south side countryside of Syria is plunged in darkness because natural gas supplies have been cut off. It takes a while to repair these pipelines and uh, therefore the entire supply chain uh, uh, infrastructure is in a disarray and uh, gas pressure in the surrounding uh, pipelines has also fallen. So whenever there are supply side constraints, whenever there are disruptions in these kind of uh, supplies, uh, markets, financial markets, speculative markets, commodity markets tend to push asset prices higher in anticipation of uh, a price rise. And that is precisely what has happened uh, to natural gas also. So uh, we'll need to keep our ears to the ground and uh, see what's happening uh, in uh, both uh, Syria as well as uh, in, in uh, uh, the uh, hurricane uh, front, both Marco and Laura. While uh, there would be some uh, natural gas traders who would say that uh, the 320 billion cubic feet find of natural gas uh, by Turkey is a game changer, which I think it is because of the huge uh, uh, reserves that Turkey has announced. But do remember that these will not be available to the world before the year 2023. A lot of water can pass from under the bridge in that time frame. So let's not count our chickens before they are hatched. 2023 is a while away. So uh, uh, I'm keeping my ears on the ground on your behalf. Uh, remain assured uh, uh, as and when 
the situation is conducive. Uh, the next trade in natural gas is coming your way. In the interim, uh, do let me know what you think of this video by letting me know in the comment section and what else you would want me to record in my next video. If you're watching this video on YouTube, please don't forget to click like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And let me reach out to fellow traders who are interested in knowledge and uh, 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 a 360 degree approach to financial markets and informed way to trade the markets by recommending my video to your family and friends. Do take very good care of yourself, your health, your family, your trades and uh, your investments. Vijayabam Bhani signing off for now till we meet again in my next video. Thank you for watching me. Bye-bye. Also, do not forget to subscribe to my free email newsletter, Fast Profits Daily, and get my free guide, How to Trade Markets Like a Pro.